Future cut his dreadlocks. And we've seen a lot of other rappers doing the same thing. Today I'm gonna show you why and why it's becoming more popular. Yes, that's right. Future cut his dreadlocks just like a lot of other rappers we see. We just seen that Lil Durk actually combined all of his locks and cut his locks to make them shorter. Um, who else cut the locks? Lil Pump did it multiple times, Lil Uzi Vert did it multiple times, and both of them are actually part of the reason why it's more popular now. But why in particular did Future do it, considering he's had his locks for, seems like, years. Many of you have seen his hairstyle, and he wears it consistently. It's just the braids back. It's a very basic, very simple hairstyle to do, but it's his iconic hairstyle. He wears it all the time. So that's one of the main reasons is that you kind of get tired of doing the same thing over and over and over again. This is my second set of locks and I actually cut off my first set of locks because I just got tired of doing the same thing over and over again. And that mostly happens because of the locks being long. When the locks become long, just like futures, and you've had them for multiple years, you keep doing the same hairstyles and it kind of just gets old and bland. If you don't have locks for any religious reasons and you do it just for the style, it makes it very easy for you to lose interest in your locks over time and want to do something different. And no, I'm not encouraging you to have some sort of religious reason for you to have your locks <sighs> and me personally i, I think that's kind of silly like <laughs> i don't know with that being said comment down below what was your reason for getting locks was it a person was it a belief you had i really want to know another thing we've seen future do quite a bit was just like a bun in the back and it was just messy and although future did quite a bit of hairstyles we never really seen him have a super maintained look with the hair being twisted perfectly and of course that's how his hair would start out when he would do a hairstyle and you know go in and get retwisted and get the hair done and honestly that's a good thing i would encourage you guys if you do different hairstyles and do retwists like allow your hair to go for a little bit before you do another retwist or before you do another hairstyle so that you can give your scalp time to recover. Getting and having locks has a lot to do with stress and release. Stress being all the maintenance that you put into it by twisting with gel or crochet hooking or doing different hairstyles because that can sometimes leave stress on the scalp and also on you because it takes a lot of time and effort to put into locks to create them. And then the release comes when you're not doing any maintenance and you allow it to do its own thing for a little bit and lock up on its own. Now, of course, that's not completely free form, but it's just allowing the hair to lock up naturally before you go back in and maintain it again. Think of maintenance as just maintaining your sections and not necessarily creating the locks. That is, of course, if you're not doing instant locks, like using a crochet hook to instantly lock it up, and you can do that within 24 hours. And of course, you see again, he has the bun in, and of course, it looks nice, and it's actually very convenient, just like me. This is my convenient hairstyle right here. This is me waking up and pulling my hair up. That's all I do. And of course, there are days where I'm mainly focusing on my hair so that I can maintain it, just like the stress and release I was talking about. But even with looking at some of these photos, it almost resembles how Young Thug's hair looked after he had cut it and reinstalled them. Just with this right here, it almost looks like he did cut his locks and then reinstall them right here. I mean, I really wouldn't be surprised. It's very popular. We've seen multiple celebrities do this. But since this is my first video on Future, I'm gonna talk to you a little bit about how to get your locks just like his. It's actually very plain and simple. He did the traditional route with twisting with gel, and he did a lot of stress and release with just twisting with gel and then allowing it to lock up over time and then continuing to do that process. And then alongside twisting with gel, he would do different hairstyles like the braids that we've seen and also two strand twist. But his most popular hairstyle is doing the cornrows back. Now let me not forget about his hair type. He does have a 4C hair type, which makes it very easy for the hair to lock up. But even with his hair being long right here, you can still see that his tips were cut off. So this isn't his first time cutting his locks. He's been cutting his locks throughout his entire time of having them. And I believe this is becoming more popular because because of those SoundCloud rappers that came into the game with shorter locks and obviously the rise of YouTubers with locks. And there have been many trends within the area of the high top locks and also the shorter locks and then maintaining their length and also having the bleach and dyed locks. All of these things have influenced a lot of people with dreadlocks to either have shorter locks, trim their locks, cut their locks, bleach and dye their locks. All of these influencers are coming from a lot of these people. But that was future and of course in the near future, <laughs> we're gonna be looking at Young Don. I'll see you guys next time. Peace. Are you tired of using mediocre dreadlock products that leave your hair feeling dry and lifeless? Try GreatLocks.com Dreadlock products, specially formulated to nourish and maintain your locks, leaving them looking and feeling healthy and strong. From shampoo and oil to locking gel and crochet hooks, GreatLocks.com has everything you need to take care of your dreadlocks. Give your dreadlocks the care they deserve. Try GreatLocks.com Dreadlock products today.